No, just say, do you notice anything different about me? What, to you or to them? To them. Oh. Do you notice any difference about Tom? That's what you wanted me to say. No! Do you notice anything different about... You say, do you notice anything different about me? Oh, that's what I did say, do you notice anything no. different? Do you notice anything different about me? Say that. It's a new top. And oh. new shorts. Yeah, and new shorts. Um, but I've had a shave. And Tom, how would you describe my moustache? Do you want the truth of a lie? Oh, what was it, what you called it before? What have you done? But I, you might have used some other words in there. No, but how did you describe it? I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. You said my porn star moustache. Oh, uh, yeah. I don't think so. I think I look quite... Dapper. Darling Dapper. A bit like Inspector Frost. I thought you were going to say Inspector Gadget then. Oh, I'll do with this arm. But um, if Inspector Frost, which is David Jason's... Oh yeah. Detective. Yeah. Squirrel. Sorry, I'm, I'm like the dog from up. And I see a squirrel, I've got to go, squirrel! Yeah. What's he called, the dog from up? Is it dog? Dog. Yeah, dog. Dog. Because it's the air trip for five and this will be a good place to dump beer cans. I don't know. Let's go and have a look at the street art on the other side. Note, I say street art, not graffiti. The difference between graffiti and street art is that's artistic. And where it's just a tag. That's graffiti. If you uh, look back, graffiti. This is going to be another boring bit. Get ready for the Zeds coming up. Um, even Romans have graffiti, that's where we get it from, from the Latin. But throughout history, you'll see different periods, and it was always named Wazir. So that's basically what tagging is. You might not be able to hear me because of the road going over. We're not alone, Tom. We're not alone. behind us is the um, A555 and um, when it first um, opened 
the had an open day where you could walk along, get up hired bikes, and we hired a couple of bikes and cycled up part of the new bit. And I want to walk up it. Yeah, we've said we'll always walk up We would always walk up it. But I drive along it more often than that. But I think that'd be perfect for another video, just walking along and um, seeing the sights. Seeing the sights. I'm finishing off at the airport. Get the coffee. So Tom, which one was your favourite stone? I didn't really have a favourite one, but um, I like that it's a sense of community. Even though we can't be in community because of lockdown, we can't be out and not about and like we used to be. Yeah. So it's kind of like a new kind of community that they're, they're setting up. Yeah, because we were here um, last week and the, the trail was like half the size. So like you say, yeah. it's growing, even though it's a time when we can't really be together as such. Yeah. It, people are still keeping it and going. there's loads of Facebook pages with like Stop Up Rocks, Romney Rocks. Uh, so go on Facebook and check them out if you yeah. want. Okay, so that's the end of this walk vlog that we've done today, walking around Poynton and seeing the artworks underneath the bridge and seeing the little community stones. How do you think it went? Good. 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 Um, how do you think we can improve? Do something else. And we'll see you in the next video. Thumbs up.